All right, we are checking out the Kali Linux light. So I just wanted to look at the light because I did that other video and I, I can always kind of rate uh, how popular a distro is, uh, just how many views it gets on my channel. And I've never really looked at a Kali Linux. And it seems like this thing is a lot more popular than I even thought it was because that video, the last one I did, uh, it's getting a lot of views. So uh, I, I thought, well, let me download the light. I'll show you what uh, the light you know, looks like compared to the other one. And you notice it's the same. It has all this same software, but it doesn't have all that other stuff installed. And you've got the links. You can install it yourself there. So there is the settings. You've got accessories, graphics, internet, you know pretty clean canvas and of course it still has the undercover mode which they did an excellent job with look at that it looks just like windows 10 now pretty good job not bad at all so let's uh go back i just want to show you something else uh you go to the alpha networks website here they have their own little link here so you got products here this is like uh they sell kind of a network cards there you got everything here uh indoor outdoor uh ethernet antennas they got all kind of stuff here but you see right up here it's got a link cali wi-fi usb so here's the uh card that i was talking about but this one is the in band uh this one pretty much looks you know looks like the one i was talking about but it doesn't have the ray link rt3070 and this is an in-band BGN. The one I was talking about had, uh, it was just a, uh, you know, it was an older one, BG. And I think it was the uh, 36, just H, not the NH. <clears throat> but, you know, that's what the card looks like. But besides that, I just wanted to point out that this is how popular uh, this Kali Linux is that Alpha Networks, has a link right there on their website Cali Wi-Fi USBs and then they show you a couple of USBs there and even an internal one so there's some uh, you know USB cards that you can use that I guess uh, they're saying works great with Cali you know so I just wanted to show you that so and this is the light build same as that other build but it just doesn't have all that other software installed you can go here of course and there's all the links right there if you want to install whatever you want you know it's just a little bit of a cleaner build instead of having all that stuff installed maybe you don't want all that stuff installed you want a little bit of a cleaner build and of course it still has the undercover mode which they did a great job. I mean, I got to give it to them. They did a great job with this theme. One click, turns it on, changes the wallpaper, changes your icon, changes the theme, and it looks really good. It looks real good. Look at that. It looks just like Windows 10. I mean, from a distance, you wouldn't know if this was Windows 10. It looks pretty good. They did a good job. One click, turn it back off. And there you go, back on Kali Linux. So that, I uh, just wanted to point out that uh, that's how popular this uh, little distro here is. They got their own link, and I've seen this link before. This is the only one I could remember uh, doing this video. But I've seen that Kali Linux has links like this on other, uh, you know, what is it networking stuff and i've just seen it around you know that it has but this one i remember seeing this so there it is cali wi-fi usb so there that is pretty neat little distro you know it's xfce can't go wrong with that it's built on debian you know stable and it's just going to work great it's not going to give you any problems because of those two things and it's really not that bad of a little distro as far as what's installed on it. It's pretty clean canvas, you know. Matter of fact, it's actually a pretty, pretty clean canvas. Multimedia just has CASM, Pro Media Player, except for, you know, the normal stuff. No office. And it's got that pretty neat 
undercover mode. Of course, you can install all that uh, Wi-Fi stuff yourself. And there's all the system settings. I think they did a good job with this uh, build here and the other Kali Linux. I'm going to have to start looking at these more because uh, they're pretty uh, popular. They're uh, up there. Just wish they'd fix this icon. I don't know if there's another icon in there. Uh, that's the only thing I'd notice wrong with this build is the, I don't know if that's uh, VirtualBox doing that because I noticed the icon there is not, I don't think it's VirtualBox might be, be the icons. Let's see, it might be the flat Remax Dark. Let's uh, try another one here. Now that one disappears. Let's try this one. Of course the sound comes back. This one works with the Windows 10. So it's just the flat Remix dark blue uh, icons are not working. Maybe that's something they'll fix uh, down the line here. But other than that, I'm sure this is a pretty neat build. And this is the light version. Just doesn't have all that stuff installed if you didn't like it. So that's pretty neat. I just wanted to show you that. There's a link right there. Kali USB Wi-Fi things you can choose from. And that's one of the cards that I was talking about. Of course, they got newer ones now. The AC band, the N band, and let's see what this one is. This one is a BGN2. This one has the Anthuros, uh, uh, what's it called, Car, uh, chipset in it. This one has the Ray Link. And there, there's, uh, let's see, there's the Ray Link. Ray Link's not bad. I got some cards with the Ray Link. The uh, 3072, uh, 3070 and 3072. And um, then I have some with the, that's another media. They, they went from late. This is the same MediaTek. They changed their name to MediaTek instead of Raylink. And then I have some with uh, the Realtek. So the Realtek was uh, the first one I had. And it was this card right here, but it was just a BG uh, band. So uh, let's see, they got Realtek, they got Raylink, and it, what's this one called? Atheros or something. So there's that one. And I've never had one of these uh, cards, although my uh, Wi Fi that's internal on this Dell is uh, that brand. Qualcomm so there that is uh, I guess I just want to wrap this up here not much more to look at pretty neat uh, build right here there's all the wallpapers of course you know it's just the uh, light build from uh, the other Kali Linux uh, what was it 2019.04 so yeah I guess I'm going to wrap this one up here and uh, that'll be that huh all right I'm out